This is an addendum to the uh, build journal for the Mark III and took it out a couple times and had it on the battlefield and I found that if you had new darts, if you had very nice darts, the way the barrel system worked here with the opening, it, it worked just fine for testing and everything. But if you got a little bit of a bad dart, something a little bit close, about every one in ten shots would kind of clip the edge of this inside barrel right here. And you get misfires and they'd spin out and, and it was not um, what I would consider an acceptable uh, level of performance for that. So, based on what some of the guys I've seen down in Australia have done, I took a crack at putting a 9 16 inch brass barrel all through the back of it. Notched it here and here so that it would um, fit correctly into the clip and the clip would feed directly in there and then I notched windows for each of the floor flywheels as it's coming down through. So, going to give this a try, see if this does better see how much of an accuracy improvement I can get to that. Obviously you're not going to be hitting uh, darts here if they're coming through the barrel. This is a final shot of the uh, Mark III with the brass barrel in there. Um, with the brass barrel installed it's losing about 20 feet per second and uh, on shooting elite darts um, before it was hitting in the high 150s with the brass barrel, it's hitting in the high 130s, shooting with elite darts. And there's a little bit more of a spread because some of the shots down in the 120s, some of the shots up in the 140s. But the accuracy on this is an amazing improvement. Um, shooting 50 feet, um, and I was using FVJs for this test. I have a tree in my yard that I use in my testing. It's 16 inches wide. And at 50 feet away, I was hitting that 6 out of 10 times. And the ones that missed were just barely missing on the outside. The track, the trajectory was nice, consistent going in. This was a drastic improvement in, in the accuracy of the gun. So I think I'm going to leave it in there. It's a trade-off. I'm losing quite a bit of velocity, but I'm gaining quite a bit of accuracy on it.